Okay, finally some interaction, that means we can get started, so nice live reaction. Okay, so to add context to what that fucking image is, uh, it's ultra kill related, so you know, it's degen degenerate fucking trash. Essentially put, I beat no connection record by just fucking milliseconds. So you know, that's space tell. So anyway, huh? Hello anyone, everyone, whoever passes by, how you doing? Hello Brazero and Captain Nemo. Today we're just gonna be doing some basic bitch prize fights and rifts. I, got, I found a, pre, a pretty special opponent. If uh, three dots and a three ring a bell, then you may know who it is already, but that's the only hint I'm gonna give. Three dots and a three, that's gonna be it. If you know, you know. Wait, they travel hard doing. So anyway, uh, a bit of an update as to what I'm currently working on. It's pro pretty much a pretty much much more basic video compared to the last one. I just needed to give myself a bit of a break compared to the massive amounts of retries the last one took. It's essentially at the any revisited video that I'm not sure if some people requested, but you know, I wanted to actually redo that one. And I was never actually fully satisfied after up uploading it. I actually, in retrospect, I thought, think it's very flawed. And, you know, it it should have some improvement on so in several areas. Context on top left pick, already explained it, but basically I beat it. No connection in an ultra kill level by fucking milliseconds. The guy with a fucking persona profile picture, that's me. It says relentless wang attack below. Uh, that's a bit of extra information, I guess. Uh, yeah, I've been kicking no connections ass on fucking ultra kill. Because uh, that's what dick measuring contests are all about. Just wait on the Cosmic and Surf review. Yeah, that one's gonna take a bit of a, a while because I wanna have all of them together. I wanna review all the trimest trimester, would you call it? Variants. Yeah, that's what I would like to do. Like when the I'll be able to get to review them by the time the the Bay Open Road Fortune are out, essentially. So, you know, I gotta wait until March. But um, the TLDR would be that um, I think they're pretty good. Like, well, Cosmic is just kind of there. She probably functions, but she's just kind of there. Seraph, I heard she's pretty cracked. Not sure how cracked. And Danny make. I'm not sure if Danny actually has her, but those that have it will actually be able to confirm it. <laughs> Draves came by. How you doing, Draves? Motherfucker with this, uh, with obsession, I don't know. Ah, uh, I just think, oh fuck, no connection is also here. Excuse me, what the fuck is that live reaction? <laughs> I just fucking had to, I'm sorry. <laughs> the temptation was too strong. And of course I had to pick the most insulting fucking difference. Like, I'm probably more proud of the <laughs> P rank one, but <laughs> I of, of course I had to go with the <laughs> one with the least difference possible. But yeah, uh, <laughs> oh, patiently awaiting for you to kick my ass. If possible, of course. <laughs> Fucking hell, I've, I've been too dedicated to Ultra Kill. Like, I just, like I was saying, I've been beating. No Connections records. I got his uh, any percent record in P-2 as, as well, apart from the P-rank one, so... Yeah, I've been fucking dedicated, alright? And... I don't even know how to do coin shit. So needless to say, I know how to kill things. That, don't, that, don't, that do not require coins and whatever. You're getting cooked. Indeed, you are getting cooked. But just some fucking low skill with coins or whatever. 
Well, that's uh, the past, and the current thing is this fucking. Uh, the fucking game. That nobody fucking likes. Expecting a Shrek references reference when you review Ogre. Yeah, something will, will come up. The, maybe I'll just do a shitty variation on the Somebody Once Stole Me opening. It's like, it opens the door and it showcases the score or something. Something will come up. But for the record, and for the record, the the fourth movie is the best one. Be I will not. I will refuse to elaborate further. But it's the best one. Just want to play Monster Hunter, but Kevin dragged me into Ultra Kill. I don't know. Just play Monster Hunter. Just keep playing it. I'm sure nothing will happen. I'm sure. I'm sure it will be a okay. You should. You should keep. You should keep playing Monster Hunter. I'm pretty sure it's good. Wrong opinion. Two is better than every other. Yeah, and and for what fact I know that you watch a thrillers, but that's besides the point. No. Clueless, indeed. I'm Just... surprised I haven't tried four four yet. Oh, I tried. That one's still uh, that one's still a bit on the resisting end. It, It'll go, it'll go down eventually, but I need to know how to kill that bee too better. It doesn't fall to the coin bug, so... You gotta set up nails. Bring me ultra kill to see how bad I am. Nah, I could gift it to you. A means of payment for all the things you've done for me so far. Like repay the favor and all. And in exchange I just g give you the... I just give you the gift of fucking mental ill. It's all in the coins for 4 4 again. Oh, really? That he actually does do you actually do the whole combo thing? Where you just keep on juggling? I thought it was actually I thought it was I thought it, that wasn't how it worked. Who knows? When are you planning to make the long awaited feet? You fucking people, dude. I'm not... Are you really that fucking down bad? Fuck's sake, man. I did reveal the face, though. You are not ready for what you are but you just gotta look for it. I couldn't accept it still paying this shiny LC speedrun. I don't know, I'm a generous man. What do you want me to say? Well, generous on my own way, but probably not. I'm a bit of a rat. They're our only fans. Never. I'm not, I'm not fucking doing that. Fucking thirsty ass wipes. Not, not opening a goddamn only fan. You know how B2 keeps your coins in the air for, and shoots them for you? Punch them before they are red and he keeps them airborne. Okay, that's a little. I think that's a little too much to take into right now, but I think I'll keep that in mind. Oh shit. Okay, there you go. Think of the money, Kevin. Uh, I don't think that's gonna work with... That argument is not gonna work with me, I'm afraid. At least when it comes to OnlyFans. If it were other things, perhaps, but not really. Alright, easy tip. TLDR, you are fast enough. He will only focus on the coins instead of... You so coin punch spam. Fucking hell. It's all about a fucking fistful of dollar with that motherfucker. But yeah, maybe I'll try it. Either that or I'll just or I'll just depend on sauce. I'll go podcast mod at head. I have to paint like six acrylic pictures for tomorrow. Yeah, good luck with that man. I've seen you actually post some of that progress and it's been pretty good actually. As well, get paid for it. Fuck's sake, you people. Is Lovecrafted, is Lovecrafted outdated by class, but she still does has the job. In terms of heavy bleeding, I would say Class Cutter does, does it better than Lovecrafted. By principle of just, uh, just being faster, right? 
Lovecrafted at least has the advantage of curse, which is pretty good. And the permakill is also a heavy convenience. So it's like trading technicality for uh, for speed. And usually the speed wins out in the end. Like The technical aspect is much more reserved for things like Death Wish or something like uh, a Killjoy. And I would say Lovecrafted is a, bit, a little outdated because she likes recovery. Hera Perrin is good. I actually like Hera Perrin. I think she's actually pretty convenient. So yeah, I would actually recommend her. I love how Lovecraft the left in the face of Regent Delius. True. Very true. Is that even between Elsie and Crosscutter? That what? I'm not sure what you mean. Brain, we get the Elfel Valentine Dali in the next type update. I'm not sure which... Well, I don't know which... Which one is that? What I mean, I mean, uh, I'm not sure which one I would like. I guess that Toho one with like the cape thing, or maybe no, actually the vial from Mega Man X palette that would actually be sick. That and maybe Demo one, because uh, Demo one's kind of iconic, and you could do a, some cool thing that it switches palette depending on the side you're on. That would actually be really cool, like. If you're playing on your side, you're red, and if it's the opponent, it's blue. That would actually be pretty cool for a pallet idea. But you never know. Oi, oi, don't, dis don't disrespect my, my franchise Mega Man. I mean, they're outdated and all, but it's, it's good shit. Fucking A. <laughs> what? <laughs> the guy who sold his dog for TF2 in-game I... I mean, it's not worse than the guy that robbed a bank for a Genshin Impact character. So, uh, yeah, I don't know, dude. It's true. Yeah, I honestly believe it. I've, I've seen much worse stories, honestly. Wait, one. Yeah, I don't, I'm not lying either. Some guy actually, actually spent all his money to get some Genshin character, and he didn't get it and tried to rob a bank for it. Insane shit just for some anime PNG. You just gotta chase that grind and you gotta respect it sometimes. I don't know. Sometimes one hurts, here's uh, the most bad shit, insane shit, and just. What a. Was a bank robber in Florida. He was American at least. I asked Resh this, now I'm asking you thoughts on Plants vs Zombies 3. I don't know, I never play them. Good for those that like it, but that's about it. Look, I got Dahlia Braindrot, but I ain't that fast buck oil. Grayson might be though. <laughs> Grayson might be. <laughs> and you should sure at least got the... Uh, host polls to put you down a little bit. It's like you got way too many hosts, and it's like, okay, I'm not gonna wail too much, otherwise, I'm gonna keep in getting go hosts like nobody's business. What prestige do you have her at? Like, is it already a hundred or what? Elfeld, please, it's gonna be Ram just to spite you. And if it's not Rem, it's gonna be... They're gonna make a Jackal one. <laughs> All of them are 100, but let me break it down. Yeah, and then they release a new one, it's gonna be the same grind all over again. Because I'm fucking positive they'll release a new one eventually. Meanwhile, on my side, I've been pretty slow in terms of squiggly prestige raisings, like... I've been pretty much stuck with the same prestige levels for a long while, like... I got a lot of them maxed out, but... Uh, Plot Twister is stuck at 40, Demon R is at 30... And Necro Breaker at 12. The rest, are all, all of them are maxed out. Bridge and Umbrella, Mother City is a possibility. 
I don't know, I don't, I don't really see it. It could be, but I don't really see it. Hoist was first to max PA since I tried for 4, but get pulling her 6 times. I only pulled 1 for 4 and slow down on wheeling and max PA her too. Nice. Mine, I think, are, mine is like uh, level 60 or so. So yeah, speaking of Dahlia, we're going for some ultra killing, baby. Because, uh, yeah, that's what I do. Oh yeah, I gotta show you the fucking project I've been working on. The third one's soon to be evolved. I've managed to collect the necessary fodder for it. Speaking of Dahlia, <laughs> now you show up, you fuck ass. How you doing, Grayson? Glad you sh you tuned in because I'm showcasing here the eventual evolution of bare bones. I'm lacking the essences for it because I'm like one one essence short basically, and that'll complete the trifecta. On a similar story, here we have a scrub and the father, and we're pretty much waiting to get enough father to actually evolve her, <laughs> so that we can complete the fucking trifecta. And essentially it's just mental illness and I don't know why I showcase it. I guess because it's cool. Okay, hold on, let me actually grind this one. Kevin pulling a Ken. Yeah, and also uh, a new one with the bare bones. Basa Kaer Kuroirozuki. Wanna be Ken? Oh, I'll surpass Ken. <laughs> if I can pull off a, a third one. This will be the third triple one that I have. Requesting Octoplasm gameplay uh, afterwards. Okay, hold on. Let me actually do some bare bones shit. I can do some magical trickery. Oh. And she's about to die. And um, nah, never mind. She actually resisted because of the thing. But she's pretty much dead now. So that's still cool. This is the sickest trick ever. It's just you can easily so you can so easily kill them with that. A level one Marie could actually pull this off. Actually, okay, now I'm actually fucking tempted. I'm actually fucking tempted, real quick. Arkham 115 is, is gonna be our victim for the night. To be fair, I can catch up if a new Dahlia drops since I'm hoarding enough relics. Fair. Okay, this will be the one. Needless to say, this is some heavy risk shit. So if I die quickly, uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's gonna be at a disadvantage that it's gonna have very low uh, cooldown, but other than that, uh, it's cool. Yo, Fire Essence. Oh, okay, I, I tapped way too much, my bad. Well, we have to actually sit this one out. Okay, I almost died there. Fucking idiot. For it. I got a little too cocky. Or rather, I just got way too preventive. And of course, Danny tunes in. Yeah, you, you probably would have pulled it off first try, wouldn't you, you fuckhead? I know Red Rider is yet to be dropped. Yeah, until fucking uh, until fucking April. Now, but I swear that was honestly the, still the worst decision they could have made. Like, why nine months? That's so fucking sad and pathetic. I mean, they're probably trying to install some some form some form of FOMO, but still. It's like fucking hell. That's like the first. No, I don't think it's the first time. But if it's gonna be a recurring thing, then it really is gonna hurt. I just hope they come. They go back to their senses eventually. It's like 
Actually, we're gonna release alongside the alongside the see which alongside the July ones, we'll release the October ones and so on. That's what gamers do nowadays, FOMO. I mean, pretty much it is f for the sake of selling, but it's still, it's kind of, uh, I don't know, it just doesn't, it feels wrong, at least compared to the track record HPS is to have. And it also hurts because of the fact that they've been reselling them with the fucking... Oh shit, it froze. Okay, it actually kind of froze there for a second, just give it a sec. The camera ain't working tonight. Sped up music for a bit. <laughs> Alright, that's kind of embarrassing. Okay, let's see if I can pull it off this time. Oh, fuck. I, okay, I know... I now figured out what it is. I actually think it is that I... Think... I usually think that I have like five hits. But no, I actually have three. Because I don't have the thing invested. I got a... Got a mentally exercise that I have only three hits. Okay, actually, okay, hold on. Let me, let me, real quick. Let me actually try to recast this thing because it's just lagging way too much. Death Street moment. Yeah, no shit. My internet's bad. What do you want me to say? I don't happen to have like some. Slideshow and skill issue. Oh, fuck you. I just... I bet you actually would suffer the same thing. It's like... I'm too used to the fucking... Five hits thing. What you want me to say? What do you want me to say, man? Anyway, let's see if this actually fucking works. No music, though. Fuck you. There's a bit of lag on your stream. Yeah, there's also a Danny 17s on stream. That's why. I blame Fortnite for this game in practice. I don't know what Fortnite is to blame. One thing for sure, though, too many nine-year-olds on the internet. That's what I blame Fortnite for. Motherfucker came and he liked the stream. Yeah, it's Danny's fault. No doubt about it. Anyway, someone requested a uh, Octoplasm gameplay before. Not gonna try the barebones shit anymore. Because I'm just way too used to the five hits thing, okay? That's just a mental problem. Well, that's a way. Okay, that's an awful way of praising it, but basically, I'm too used to five hits. What I mean to say. So who leads though? What's gonna lead up to plasma? She can actually catch. Marie can actually catch uh, the wolf shoot pretty well. It's gonna stop off the units because HPS is gonna hoard all the exclusive variants like still Christmas last year. Like last year. Yeah, that's uh, honestly the cautious way of doing things. Because by this point, you just never know. So anyway, not much to say about Octoplasm herself. I mean, it's debuff extension if you're actually into that. It doesn't apply to enemy buffs. Like, here, you just transfer the curse there and... Oopsie. You just transfer the curse there and... Of course, she takes it away. Oh, shit. The good thing is, uh, 20 second curse. For Apex, at least. So there's that. Fortnite had battle passes that had skins. Of characters only locked to set battle passes. That never returned creating FOMO. Was it just Fortnite? I'm pretty sure. Or maybe the trend itself started earlier. Like, I'm not saying you're wrong, but... For some reason, it sounds like something that came before him. And that Fortnite simply adapted. And because it was incredibly popular... They obviously... Well, I obviously got a lot of recognitions for it. Apex is too good. 
Yeah, you probably have a thousand hours in Apex Legends. Now, I know you mean the bear in itself, but that's uh, true. Moon disease strikes back. Oh, yeah, speaking of moon. <laughs> and that's for later, though. You can call her for it, but that's for later. Gave it about um, half an hour or so. Let's go. I would you call bullying, but it's all for the content. That's what I said. That's why I said the thing about the two dots and the three. That makes the shitty kitty face. I don't understand how she gets so pissed when I type two dots and a two. Like. <laughs> It's basically explosion mode. It's fucking hilarious. Ah, fuck. There it is! <laughs> the fucking kitty face. You better use that shiny freeze on her freeze frame or on her base. I'll see where I can use it, but I'll try. At least a shiny peacock has to be used. That's uh, that's uh, mandatory. All right, that was pretty easy. Uh, child drop kicking. Sing she just beats her in a single combo and perma kills the teammates. Pretty. This is the one thing that Lovecraft would excel against Glass Cutter. Um, easier disposal of Death Wish. Most of the time, anyway. Anyway. Hey, Sakura, how are you doing? <laughs> fucking, fucking, the fucking dumb. Double dot two though. I don't know, it's just funny. But it has to be covered, otherwise the joke itself loses its luster. Okay, we gotta watch it. Okay, easy. So anyway, any thoughts on that new Persona remake that I've been seeing a lot of clips of? <laughs> like, <laughs> one of the reasons I got that new profile picture on Steam is because of that. There's just way too much Persona content out there. I've been pretty much spoiled of the whole fucking trilogy though. <laughs> I don't care for spoilers. I just watch the funny moments of the games. It's alright, not gonna lie. Yeah, that uh, seems to be the consensus. My my first thought is that, it, while it's a gr good remake, I don't think it needed to happen. It's like, the original is still perfectly playable, it's just kind of there. Or at least they j just don't push it because it looks old and chibi and way too PlayStation 2. Or some bullshit about renderware because it belongs to EA and it's not easy to republish or something. Or some bullshit like that, I don't really know. My point is... Uh, the original Persona 3 was perfectly playable, so I think the remake feels just redundant. Not necessarily bad, but just redundant. But you never know, there probably can be new additions or whatever else. Having said, if I ever get into it, I'll probably start with uh, either 3 or the, f or the or fucking first one. It's a lot of weed, man. If you want to play Persona, just play sh SMT. Yeah, I heard it's just the Persona, but just the gameplay, and not the dating sim shit. I actually might consider it, though. 
Like Persona is just for watching the cutscenes. SMT is for actually playing it. That's the consensus that I got from everyone's thoughts on both franchises. Never touch a Persona game, but the music is good. Yeah, that's... Uh, you just hear a... Take a shot every time you see a video with... Uh, the, so, some track from Persona 5. Or Catherine. Also include Catherine. Because it's also Atlas shit. Intellect level 1. Uh, that's Danny. And also, hey Angel, how you doing? Music, music laps harder than a drunk stepdad. Well, uh, takes one to know one, I would say. Time for some Lakush. What the fuck? <laughs> Catherine was my introduction to Atlas games for better or worse. Yeah, uh, I can see it. My first Atlas game was actually some some shitty Game Boy Advance dodgeball game, actually. It it is a strange origin, but strange origin, but one has to start from somewhere, I guess. Persona music is cool and all, but have you heard of John Jacuzzi music? No, I heard of John Hotline Miami one. It's also pretty pretty sick. Anyway, this should be pretty easy. Most of them don't have any moves. The only realistically threatening one is uh, Unholy Host. But otherwise, it should be on the bag. Just got a heal blocker real quick. There it is. Nice. Easy tip. Trauma Center is Atlas's Magnum Opus on the Spiro. General Breeze slaps. Yeah, you know that you know that one because of the fucking YTPs, be honest. You only know about those games because of the fucking song that would be endlessly used on YTPs. Otherwise, nobody would care that much for about Trauma Center. That is a fact. <laughs> I only knew Atlas that Shin Megami Tensei was a thing to do the featuring Dan from the Devil May Cry series. Yeah, that, that stupid sticker was fucking infamous. And I don't really know why. <laughs> it's like... There, there probably were other Dantes for all we know. I just wanted to clarify it. I think this will be the last uh, fight and then we'll want to rip. So, you know, it is a little more interesting. No, for real though, I want Hakita to get perturbator of informal ultra guild. So, yeah, honestly. He has to get someone from the OST of Hotline Miami, otherwise uh, uh, it's gonna be just criminal to not include one of the most goaded musicians out there. It's like, you got fucking Carpenter, Brute, Perturbator, uh, Moon, and Sun are all, and many others. Like, take your fucking pick, they're all fucking excellent. Oh, and also, and also, I am the kid, you know what I mean. That's actually someone's artist name. Anyways, uh, Kitty Face. The boss seems kind of difficult. We gotta give it that. <laughs> Only two! Oh man. Watch me blunder it anyway, but still, only two. Okay, that's a new romancer, or that one. Whichever we want, really. I think I'll go with Grape Digger here. Depends on how wrong it is. Not very. Yeah, I'll go Neuromancer, which is 
I'll go with full offense uh, instead. Seems like an easy base. I don't. I haven't seen a. Just neuro it. Yeah, I'll carry a burst just in case. You never know if they actually uh, gonna hit first. Like, I try to go for a first attack on Neuromancer, but sometimes I catch you, and it can be a little annoying. Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, pretty mediocre start. Mediocre start. I can't fucking vocalize. I'm too busy laughing. Yeah, that's why I tend to block first rather than the other way around. Anyway, this can be just uh, a beatbox or whatever. It's indeed mediocre gameplay. Yeah, I wanna see yours. I bet you'd lose in the dumbest way possible, Grayson. Hmm. Okay, so we do run in a bit of a problem because Tuba Tuba could actually falter and it would ruin the whole thing. Funny losses still attracted viewers. That is true though. Yeah, fuck it, we'll evolve with this. I should invest in Strike Up the Band though. That's actually probably the better move for Beatbox. Oh shit. We ball, but I got hit by the bomb. She actually summoned that shit midway. So kind of average. Would have been good if she didn't use the bomb. Anyway, what else we had? Well, there's no cripple, so at least it will be a smooth enough ride. What's this again? TNG and Cursion Knowledge. Yeah, I'm feeling a Gravedigger for this. And... I don't know, I guess it says it. Assassin's Creed is back up. Is that attack and gag on a duo node? I don't know, dude. You tell me. Which one, Infernal Sis, Infernal Twin, or Golden Gun? No, uh, that's. Uh, I would say uh, Infernal Twin myself, because like Golden Gunner is, uh, it's not bad, but a bit too inconvenient to use. In terms, in terms of like rifts or whatnot, not a bad berry in mind you, but it is much more tricky to use. All right, that was good. That was pretty good. Grave Digger, my beloved. I actually really like that variant. I actually, I actually regret rating her just a, uh, uh, fucking four. Real fucking helpful for rifts. Falter's a lot more on prize fights, mind you, but it is uh, real, real efficient on rifts. It's like one knockdown and you gain that sweet, sweet immunity. It's the bottle. We're making it out of 14k right now. Nah, I doubt it. I think. 14k is already dead. Too many fuck ups on the solos. Gridless grave, yes or no? If you, if you go gridless, you gotta not invest on the precision aspect of it. That's actually an important note. And it could actually be somewhat helpful, but uh, it is kind of. Well, I'm, I'm not really sure. Maybe it actually is somewhat helpful. 
I don't run it myself because uh, lazy. That was a pretty half-assed half -assed explanation, but I don't know. Just don't die in 14 Ks granted. No shit. But yeah, depending on the context, it's like I'm not sure where a critless grave digger would actually fit nowadays. Maybe for like some uh, some pain wheel node, like more debuffed pain wheel shit. Who knows? What if I hypothetically get Ken's account and whale there? Am I making Ken's whale, or it's still on me? Uh, if it's your money, it's still on you, I'm afraid. That's uh, that's what, how I see it. But you know, but I guess it depends on perspective. You're making said person whale, Danny. Anyway, I'm gonna take a couple withers. Because we got a mission failed. We'll get him next time. It was my money. Oh, fuck. You got scammed, boy. Well, probably you didn't get scammed. Is that Neuro Grudge? It's it's Moon, are you surprised? <laughs> are you actually surprised? Well, I had to hit Reflect there, but good. Still giggle that you didn't get Blue Strike. I mean, I did, and then he didn't. <laughs> That's the funny part. Scam myself for real, for real. <laughs> Busted Frost uh, RTS. I think I want to do a funny thing and and go with uh, nonsense against, against most of them. But first, we gotta dispose of that uh, dark bite in the back. Otherwise, it will not, it will not work. Moon space. It is. We're doing bullying in this fucking stream. Dark Might XD. Oh shit, I got a sneak in freeze frame. Remind me what the boss has. It, it only has two catalysts, so already I can already sacrifice one thing. Sort of. Idea would be to have a wind swept for these two. For an immoral and death wish, and some, I guess, Dahlia for the biting cold. Oh, final fight is only for double. That's convenient. That's pretty convenient. So yeah, that's where we're gonna use the freeze frame. Although at the same time we could also use uh, red velvet and have uh, her finish off the likes of death wish. That's probably more tricky. Barely chat on YouTube. Yeah, it's so. You hope for BC. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Tempted to find Moon's base and bully her. <laughs> Good luck, my man. Okay, shit, I actually forgot one thing. We equipped the outtake on the other. I forgot to equip... Oh shit, did you guys see that? It was like a visual bug for a few seconds. Yeah, it was probably nothing. Well, I kind of spoiled the strategy already, so we'll just go for the kill. Ah, fuck, I think that misses. Still got it, though. Nice. No Osiris. I tend... I tend... It's not very high attack. I tend to keep it for pain wheels. And the idea was to actually have the outtake so that double could gain a shit ton of skill issue. Oh, fuck you. It's still... 
Still was a win. Eat shit, dude. Anyway, the big kahuna. I don't know where that came from, though. The, the big kahuna expression. Apparently it's like some big wave or whatever else. Win is a win. Yeah, exactly. Like, I mean, I won with a fucking BB and not much health lost. Come on now. Okay, this should not be that difficult. Hopefully. Hopefully that fucking... D DW doesn't fuck us over too much. Alright, that's a good start. Alright, that's pretty good. That's looking pretty good, Joker. Ah oh, fuck, I forgot it's done quick. Fuck, I should have. Should I sacrifice the blockbuster or just stall it out? Ah oh, fuck, I'll set. Oh! Fucking hell. I deserve that. Yeah, I deserve that. I'm, I'm a fucking idiot. Uh, in my defense, we'll say it was just to make it fair. Now I have no excuse, it's true. <laughs> well, that's a shame. But anyhow, uh, that... Professional back fumbler. Oh shit, that's me. <laughs> yeah, right in time, I fumbled the bag so that I could actually uh, give you a free revenge. Yeah, we'll go with that story. Yeah, uh, kitty face. Help, you're dying. You've fallen and you can't get up. Anyhow, let's move on. I've, I've been seeing, by the way, I've been seeing a lot of these Doomsday Device ones. Is it actually any effective unless it's outside of like maybe Umbrella shit? Because otherwise I don't really see it. I don't really get the point of those. How did you like my incredibly tainted pain wheels? They died fast as shit. That's how I like them. So, you know, a lot. It's not good? Yeah. Uh, I figured. It's actually surprising that it actually looks looked good and threatening at first, but it turned out to be on the mediocre end. Alright, let's see. Let's see how it goes. You know, at the very least I'll give it credit, it's a little more usable, but it's not a busted levels of uh, annoying. Shit, I gotta, I gotta use a blockbuster for that. Everyone hitting on Cripple, not gonna lie. And justifiably, hopefully, uh, toned down for the next one. That Marcada looked good too, guess who it is now? Guess where it is now? Maybe someone will actually make it work, who knows. But it is the the other one that actually... It is those, those two that we all know and love. Sorry, love and love. Loath or no and loath there. I got a fucking spoken. Oh, and also the angry flinches. Do people find it good? Because I haven't really struggled against it. I've lost to it because of the AI. Common. I don't know. I guess someone had should. I guess it should be like a community effort to actually make all of the catalysts, but it has to be something that is a balance for everyone. Like even uh, 
new players and she can actually easily deal with it. Anyway, let's play lottery. Hope we don't get too debuffed. Angry Flinch is good when you can't use Eliza, never. Yeah, that's you with like tw 12 uh, inner pieces. Fucking ass. Hate Nero, it's so lame. It is lame play, but it's also convenience play. It's helpful when you need her to. Otherwise, just don't use her. I, I can certainly say I just barely ever use her on prize fights because she's just boring. 16th waiting for essences. Fucking degenerate, dude. Meanwhile, I'm waiting for essences on bare bones. And fodder for uh, scrub. Which, let me check if... Uh, okay, give it a couple of seconds. Who knows, maybe father will show up. You never know. <laughs> Alright, that's a good one. It's kinda cute. We can go with like... Um, the final fight may be annoying, so... Perhaps... Uh, Who knows? One, one of these. With Bellows Blast, it's uh, easy enough. Meanwhile, I'm gonna get Underdog soon to die. Nice. Ghost Solos. I don't have Ghost Invested. Eventually, the plan... Here's the thing. I was actually going to invest in Ghost Buster. But then the fucking Shiny Bear Bones took priority and I had to evolve her. Then another one came in and that took further priority. And then the fucking third one. Bro doesn't have Ouija. I have him evolved. But it's at least uh, one step of the way. It's just investment that's lacking. Alright, fist him. Oh shit. I mean, also Crusher also sweeps. And so does Dark Horse. Kevin, I'm watching this on 144p, help. Uh, update your Wi Fi or something. Alright, what's this triple? Clean for once, <laughs> wow. Yeah, fuck you. RTS, not an invincible. Yeah, that spells a lot of immunity. Mm, my wife. Stop thinking about uh, Suki for once. And focus on Updog. Nah, let's actually just... Let's actually just go for fucking Grave Digger instead. Or... Nah, fuck it. Prism Rockstar Phantom. I don't have Prism invested. Uh, and I mean, I, I could invest it right now, I just don't want to. Because, uh... Lazy. I'm literally watching this stream stand for right now. Fuck you know. Prism is fun though. Yeah, I may I may actually give her a shot eventually. She's been on my to-do list for a while. Uh, okay, let, give me a stun. Easy there. Oh fuck, that didn't work. Well, that's gonna be a... 
I don't know, we have rest, but that's fine. Easy enough, just gotta remove shit. I want to let intrusive thoughts and evil resonant. Don't do it, it ain't worth it. Alright, please kill. A snake gonna kill. Ah, oh, fuck, special disabled. Ah, oh, fuck, that pain. Stupid bitch blocked it. Unlucky. Yeah, that was a shame. All because he decided to use Inferno out of nowhere. Skill issue, yeah, yeah, sure, just be. I mean, if, what are the chances that if I blocked it, I would have gotten hit with the, the BB3 anyway? Come on, tell me, what, what, what are the chances? Then you don't sh shower, that's like, that's a, sounds like a skill issue to me. Either that or he just lives in the shower, which is probably worse. More like medical issue. Fucking <laughs> okay, no. hell. Hey Leafy, how you doing? I just uh, playing like shit right now because uh, I don't really care for rifts too much if I'm being on. That's the cop's excuse. But I'll roll with it because of why not. He's allergic to water. Funny thing is, I once seen like uh, one of those 100 ways to die videos and it actually looked like intense shit. Like, no joke, it actually looked pretty intense, but it was probably fake. If he lived in the shower, he, he would be swollen by the water. Motherfucker is trying to scale to Aha, the Delta P! I don't know why that's uh, a mainstream thing now, but it is for some reason. Thousand Ways to Die was an interesting show. It actually left a lot of, <laughs> a lot of memories on me. Like, and it was a show, all right. That's the, that's what I'm gonna say. Yeah, I'll fucking run, mate. Wind subsidies should, should probably solo this. You have any future projects, videos you want to get out with? I've actually been considering a blasphemous review. Aside from the Ultra Kill one, because uh, Blasphemous have been playing. Fuck this low. Blasphemous have been playing all. I've played both games very recently, and pretty solid experience if I'm being honest. And also because uh, it's the perfect catalyst for Spanish shit posting. Oh shit, I gotta block that. There you go. So yeah, anyway. Uh, maybe in the future I'll do a Blasphemous review because... Uh, again, pretty solid series and... I'd really like to cover the whole two games that got out. And also a uh, Spain shitpost. Well, at least I got to shut Denny's mouth for one. Will Shrek Beowulf be as good as Standout? I don't really think so. Shrek lacks something like Chaos Banish to actually uh, get rid of uh, any buffs that got bypassed. At least that's my current take. I don't really know if he'll actually be just as good, but I'm not holding my holes up that he'll live to that standard. Okay, we got the funny note in here, because of course we would. Basically like three to four crippled deckers. Shrek is poo-poo. 
Yeah. You're gonna get you're gonna get taken to the swamp. We gotta have like UFC interview because you do the when you do the ultra kill review. Oh and also another thing that I would like to do in the future. Maybe like a review of the whole SG game and interviewing people as to why they play it and what the what they like about him, what what they hate about it. It's like, you know, actually get across the whole community. And maybe I could actually try to get like uh, fairly influential people, as in devs and whatever. Well, not so much devs, but um, s sort of celebrities, more or less, that within the community, like. Um, Sharpie or Parasols BA, yeah, Sharpie. Maybe Sharpie wouldn't be in, would be into it. And yeah, maybe the devs, but that's a little less likely. I mean, I did it with Drexel, if I recall. So the chance that I they could do it with me is uh, there, but a little less likely because I'm a crass motherfucker, and I would be willing to take shit out of context. <laughs> Like that fucking Homer Simpson interview, where he just takes shit out of context constantly. Interview Rio so he can show his entire Transformers. <laughs> oh, I, that's a... Okay, that's a bit. That should be a bit. Like, Rio's just fucking posting his Transformers collection. I'm actually in... I actually like that idea. It's like, <laughs> he just doesn't give a shit. Just showcases fucking Transformers like a fucking idiot. Interview me so I can talk about Suki for 20 fucking hours. Okay, that actually... That is actually warping into its own little segments. Like, I interview people and they all talk about different things. Things that they actually like. Fucking remove the stupid debuff, bitch. Well, fuck that. I, that was unlucky. Uh, debuff draw but yeah that would actually be a cool bit it's like I interview people and they all talk about very different things in a very fucking sporadic fashion it's like I interview who reasons it's like what's the best uh, no baby finish because I got I got weather motherfucker what, what was I supposed to do with that so yeah it's like I interview a couple of them it's like uh, so, yeah, about the game, I'm very into Ultra Kill. I really want to beat the shit out of Kevin in real life because he keeps taking my records. But otherwise, otherwise, I really like the game. It's pretty good, and I really do hope that the the whole team makes it far into the industry. Yeah, something like that. I would just state Black Dahlia lore, of course you would, fucking obsessed. Motherfucker's obsessed, alright, with the character. Alright, I'm gonna tag her out and beat the Twisted Metal first. It's... Alright, the other one's Scribble Legger, so it's kind of a... Uh, kind of a dookie. Oh, fuck. Well, at least the most annoying part should be out of the way. Or at least the one that would give us the most trouble. Now you just gotta get rid of this one. But it's just uh, time consumption. Yeah, I think I can use a blockbuster. Try to risk it. Yeah, that was pretty risky because I got a. Oh boy. Got stunned midway, but I can rec probably recover. The 
That's worthy though. Yeah, fuck it. I just deal with Kobe at this point. Okay, Rios, what's your main issue with the Rift? Alright, so here's my masterpiece, Optimus. She's real cool, and here's... Yeah, I'm gonna use X. I don't think I had it charged. Straight up dodges the question. <laughs> That, that should be the dynamics, like they dodge the question all the time. time to operate. It was charged, no, I, I don't think it was charged, but yeah, never mind. Okay, so how do we go about this one? When so will be wasteful, so that's uh, already out of the question. Now let's try Grave Digger. In conclusion, Kevin, have I told you about my wife? Uh, uh, no, send her, send her to my home so I can take it away from you. And sacrifice all her Necro Breakers in the process. Jin Solos, doesn't she? Uh, Cripple Decker. That's uh, the problem. Okay, that's at least out of the way. Then you stun her like you do all, me all the time. Kill them faster than cripple, easy. You make too many demands, you must be a pretty sad man to make this many demands. God damn, I really need grapes for that immunity. Pretty much. Bit short on health, but good. Do you have any variants that have been sitting in the dungeon for years? Unf so you mean unused? Invested but never used. Well, I got, got plenty of those actually. I guess bare bones would already qualify for that. Uh, never used the cryptid. In the Niles also. Just sitting there. Yeah, I never used cold stones. And fucked. Like that, does that mean that they never got fucked or something? I don't know. Galactic Glamoura just did it for the hell of it. Uh, what else? Temple Tyranos for the hell of it. Big Top is just really old, like one of my first variants, it just sits there, doing nothing all day. Go, nah, that would not be right. The Cripple, RTS, Hexy. Sacrifice against Death Wish. That's the only way to break the curse. Wait till the Ghost Stones Community hears about this. Um, I bet their influence is so negative that it doesn't really affect me, so I don't care. Alright, let's get a bit of a jiffy. I will try the following. Dust out the old, go, good old somersault. No, the other one, there you go. I'm legitimately considering just uh, brute forcing it with Apex. And Baltan run for that annoying Star Story mode challenge. Not even that, actually, I just invested her because I wanted to do it.
Peacock. Okay, let's see if we can actually get the shitty precision kill in this one. Hmm. Then we'll be. Yeah, I'll keep the immunity taunt. I'll just go about it. Just sketchy for boss. Yeah, fuck. I should have actually read that earlier. Oh shit, I actually got myself free from the shackles of uh, the curse. Too bad it doesn't really matter now. Alright, let's see if we can actually good for this. And it's down. Oh fuck, we can actually kill her. Whew. That was a little too close to home. But the only problem is... Uh, it ain't gonna be easy to go for the precision kill. Because our only blockbuster is bounce. Oh fuck. Well, we'll just chip her out. Yeah, not having that. That was a little close and not very optimal because of that uh, unoptimal AI pattern, but we at least didn't fuck it up that badly. Shout out to Sketchy and Made of Honor for being so good supports. Like, I've I legitimately seen people uh, criticize. Uh, uh, the other one made for the job. I need to just choose made because I'm a fucking idiot, that's why. And maybe f for this it'll work out. You lose this time, impressive. Yeah, you sound, you sound awfully cocky today. Well, it was a good run, but you gotta take the L. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not having high expectations on this, if I'm being honest. But I will give it all, I guess. Well, I will give it all. You, you fuckers just criticized. You got this. Allegedly. I should use the segment Fury instead of X. Well, now we gotta eat that for a bit. Oh, that's fucking unlucky. The stun just would not concede. Yeah, that's fucking GG. Yeah, I actually watched, I actually survived this thing. That would actually be hilarious. Local man. So somehow survives the whole thing. Never mind. Cripple deck here is that annoying. No shit. No shit, it was that annoying. Betting five dollars that you win. Why would you why the fuck would you bet five dollars though? Anyway, how do we go about this now? I don't know, I'll just I'll try this. Let's dance, darling. 
Fatigue stone. Yeah, I get it. I fucking get it. All right. I fucking get why that fucking happens. I think I already used ten that, but whatever. Damn X, what for real? Does that does that mean something or what? Oh, that's right. There's no DPDB. I can just. Let's hit her somehow. I'll pay you an exposure, that's pretty shit. Can I, can I gotta get paid two? What did I miss? Oh, what the fuck's that AI pattern shit? That was just rigged, dude. Well, at least we don't fuck it up. Well, the, the war spot is out of the way. Yeah, I thought I meant to do that. That fucking Luger though was way too fucking well timed. It's like it's fucking saw it coming. His timings are masterpiece. Anyway, I'm filling up for another one because uh, I like to see f the other f the fuck here Danny left. Maybe he'll die out of laughter. That would be hilarious. Oh shit! It's soda. Yeah, should I hit soda? Should I just? Uh, Call it suicide. Nah, that's gonna be get me banned, whatever. You just go for it. Let's go for it. What are the other guys I scared them? It's pretty much all the same. This one seems uh, slightly less bad. But that's uh Oof. Special exception. Well, at least it's not the usual shit, so I'll give you credit for that. Okay. But it is, isn't it susceptible to the... To this guy? Well, probably not. If she just uses a single special, then it's kind of jobber for the guy. And at the same time, if we get the wrong debuff, it is jobber for us. Well, I'll still, I'll still try it though. We'll see what happens. I'll go back to continuing this goodie project. I'll keep you stream up, okay? Best of luck for, for your thing. Well, uh, off tempo affected us, but should be good at least. Just oh, fuck, we gotta wait it out. And of course, she runs towards us. Thank you, fucking asshole. But safe, at least. Should have gone with the... Uh, with an invested move. I might actually uh, invest uh, more band moves. Which is a bit of a heretic statement, but... Shit, I'm actually getting a couple of kicks out of beatbox. What are the other ones? Yeah, I meant to do that. I'll go myself, break sober, but I'll still be listening to stream. Okay, good. Good luck out there, Grayson. He busted less words. Alright, that I can actually use a, a gin for. It will take a while though, because of the um the thing. Fucking less words. Like why just ban with a big combo for a point where you get Diva? combo. Uh, beatbox gets quick, mirror very quickly, so that's why. So the point was to spam as many specials as possible. 
Thing is, I got disabled specials because this game is a piece of shit. And... Yeah. Easy! That's why I actually like uh, the scrub and smash move, it's actually got pretty good odds for removal. And you couldn't do that. Yeah, actually for this, Jin uh, and some debuff removal, I guess. That would be the plan. Pretty basic bitch, but it should be efficient. Man, I love Great Digger. Should have rated her 5 stars, like I said. That's my B, honestly. The whole low attack shit doesn't really matter for Rifts. Is a Makima with the Immune Miasma better than Beatbox? Uh, I assume so. But I, I, yet again, I don't have a Makima. Maybe one of the. Then he can confirm. I, th I think he actually bought it, the motherfucker. Because of course he would fucking buy it. Well, now we gotta wait this shit up. Ooh, that was a heavy ass cut. It's still not enough, but we could heal heal out of the creature. Nah, so so. And the health total is still good enough. Just use something red there. Dew. <laughs> Dew. Fucking mirror shows up on stream. Mountain Dew. I'd like some. Nah, that's a lie. Not too much of a Mountain Dew guy. You get her attack list set. Said she'll work. Let's fucking hell, the fucking. Cat gets filled with weed the second she shows up. This is such an this is a, such a phenomenal tradition we've cooked up in this community. God, I gotta fucking upload something. Am I so far away from the mic? All right, that's a little too weak. I'll take the grab con. Yeah, I do hope they actually nerf uh, Crippled Decker because uh, Jesus Christ. That's three stuns in a row. I and mean, I can't recover it because I'm Bloodbath, I can just backdash like nobody's business, but still. That's like. Damn. Hopefully, the. I mean, we, we've yelled enough about uh, the likes of. Uh, the other one, uh, Unholy Host. So, like, surely they can listen to the requests on this one. I hope. That being said, how would you guys go about nerfing it? Like, I've actually considered it should be something like make it 15% for the fatigue to kick in. Because, like, it's gotten to the point that it that it is relevant and you know seeing it become useless would actually hurt but it should be something that it must be evened out just remove the fatigue and have it the old way but that's kind of uh it's kind of a difficult ask I and mean, i get why but at the same time what do we replace it with quietus should we actually put quietus in it that would actually be interesting you know
Character specific 50% stun. So you mean 50% fatigue? I don't know, that's still too much. You hit 5% way too often. So that's still. So that's not gonna really work. Stun if you deal, heal over 25 or something. Yeah, like. It has to be a heavy percentage. That's uh, the consensus we can all agree on. Question is how how much of that should it be to actually have it not not entirely be useless because otherwise that means people will have to dump a lot of cripple deckers at once. One stack of slow. Yeah, but that can't doesn't that kill on super slow mo in the process? That that would be a little unfortunate, maybe. Maybe it's also not the worst idea out there. It depends, it depends. It has to be balanced out carefully. But I do agree that it has to be like a massive ass percentage. Maybe 25 is like... Well, that's a fourth of the health bar, so it has to be some sort of a curbing mechanism for like hard hitters that just in one shot maybe it's like a limiter for failures if you think about it depends a little bit I don't know it, it does require a lot of thinking so anyway what do we want for this this fuck ass note here well sketchy will be a hard hard one for the next one or well, it just hide the threshold three times so it's 15% general and Nine character specific. Well, ten percent if you want to go with even numbers. Now, yeah, at least I do like them. Them even numbers. But yeah, I could actually see that. Cripple is better than Buren now. Maybe they should just return old Buren for Starmer. They would at least make it much more even. Only way I see HPS nerfing Cripple Decker is to just add in more immunity variants. Yeah, that's not gonna be the best of solutions. It's like, that's just fighting fire with fire, really. Once you get too many immunity variants, you gotta have a counter for the immunity variants and so on and so forth. Hey, what the fuck do I use for this? Hmm. 25, 20, 15, general 15, 12, 10 character specific. I don't know, maybe keep, depending on how I do with this note, keep like tabs on how much it would be, how much, how often I hit 15%. Actually, yeah, actually do that exercise, like, check how much I hit 15% for this, for this, throughout the match, to see how, how efficient it is. Save Sketchy, but the problem is, the other note has host, so Sketchy is a little less useful there. Blades IP and Wind or Dio. Again, that's a problem. The red fucker is in there. That's why, that's why I want to keep it for that. And I... That's going to be a hard end. I want to counter though. Well, depends, maybe. I was blue streak tearing you. Decently, I guess. Pretty good. To make your characters deal less than 10% yet still having decent DPS. All DPDB. Mm. Yeah, I guess so. Although actually... You know, actually come to think of it, what if, if we actually go with this, and if we also return the old DPDB, they would somewhat, they would somewhat retroactively counter each other. I don't know, fun, food for thought, I guess. 10% sounds more balanced, but only if it's character specific. Yeah. Otherwise, I think it's still correct. Anyway, I'm gonna take the advice on the whole... Keeping the other one. Yeah, this one. Let's dance, We're balling with the debuffs. 
because uh, they would activate simultaneously. Yeah, I guess. I, I was actually thinking of old DPDB for the record, not not the new one. Yeah, I should have used the fucking move, idiot. Oh, that's just great. Well, at least I can just finish her off like this. Well, unfortunately I clicked the wrong set because I wasn't paying attention. But it sh we should be good at it. We got the, the lucky timing with immunity, so we sh still good to we can sort of have fast kill her we just gotta get in just gotta get in there with a fast kill but she's not gonna make it easy on her come on Ooh. that was a little clutched okay I don't know how often I hit the 15% you do the math I th but I surely hit 5% way too often even with fucking Bloody well. Anyway, I wanted to keep actually the likes of... Uh, I'll get it. Maid of Honor for this one. Because of the... Uh, the other modifier. But I will... I'll put... I'll trust you in using Sketchy for this instead. Obviously, Windsurf for a couple of these. Do they 15% like three times or so? Hmm. Yeah, that's actually pretty a pretty fair amount, I guess. And some of them likely because I used the Creature of Isor, which is a naturally only strong move, so maybe 15% is good. Still I would like to have it done again for this when I see how it goes. We'll see. Okay, it's got autoimmune, so we gotta be watch out with our debuffs. Oh shit! I'm just gonna risk it for. Gotta wait up until that run out runs out, and roll for the curse. Oh shit. Oh, whoops. Uh, sorry about that, it just disconnected all of a sudden. Thank god it doesn't showcase uh, anything embarrassing. I just paused it. Well, we play without sound now, because uh, uh, oopsie daisy moment. Yeah, I think this one's gonna be tough to beat. Because just just too tanky. I'll try my luck with like Philia, see if I can at least brute force it enough. Oh fuck I forgot fatigue also affects cooldown. Oh that's just unlucky. Yeah, that's fucking good.
just went at it. What a fucking massive ass field day. Eh? Only one ringlet, yes, I'm a close people. That's gonna be fucking obnoxious to deal with. I should just call it quits. I think I'll just call it quits. It's impossible to win. Yeah, I'm gonna call it GG. I don't think I can win in this one. I have to rethink the strategy because I just got the other one killed. I don't have to sleep because I don't have an invested one. Yeah, that was pretty shit. I'll have to fucking go around on that fucking corrosive crap somehow. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. Malar. Malar, of course, uh, this place hold it, really. Yeah, I've been playing like shit tonight. It's not been my lucky night, alright? Bare bones solos, yeah, fuck you. Well, maybe actually, but I'm not fucking trusting my judgment. I'll do X what? Okay, so then, what do I use for this? I already spent most of resources already. Death wish maybe don't have it. Bare bones, you're you're just shitting this at this point. Come on now. But anyway, we will try with some kind of like stand out, I guess. This is just for some mild healing on the back. I don't know. Give her five specials, I don't have five specials. Yeah, I'll try that of course at least. Problem is still we he need to somehow counter the other one. We need something blue. Oh, that I have corrosive. Fuck, I'm a. Well, fuck, that's actually much uh, less stressful then. But still, it is. Now the main threat is the other one, so. I guess X Apex, really. That leaves. Uh, this for. There's my support, yeah, I got it. Marie. We have something like a weekly ban for it. I fucking hate triple death wish. Uh, honestly, that would actually be a pretty interesting idea, but I don't know how they'll execute it. Probably, probably badly, that's the main speculation. Maybe good, who knows, but not having high hopes, definitely. Anyway, I'm willing to try with like a uh, Beowulf, see how it goes. Yeah, 
Ah, eh, fuck it. I just put on a lady care. USBs instead of snake, but there's there's a problem of like him. Should be used to weaken them. Ah, fuck me. Well, it's uh, all up to this one now. Stupid stun, dude. Like, this would, wouldn't have made shit because the auto is on the way. I'm with him with that one. Yeah, but leaving the red velvet. Okay, now we've got to hope that she actually cooperates. Good enough. Now I just do the slowest shit. Chaos Vanish Cycle. Boy, this is gonna take a while, so sit back and relax. Ah, oh, fuck it. Fuck them cycle. Give it a second. Jesus Christ, it's green like nobody's business. Okay, there might, might be a chance of this. She don't use upper cat that often. Oh fuck, I didn't mean to do that. It only took like 20 seconds. I, I don't make it yet. Fuck. Yeah, that's the last one. Fuck. Well, unlucky. Calling it quits. At least I didn't get infected, infected by Cliff Cripple all that much, but holy hell, that was bad. Yeah, I'm not cut out for this. I got out for this mode, dude. Holy shit, just nerf the fuck out of Cripple. Because that was just horrible. Unlucky, pretty much. And all because of that stupid, uncooperative Eliza AI. Yeah, yeah. Well, mostly that. Anyway, I'm gonna have a gamble as consolation, so. That's gonna be a bronze, but. I'm actually hoping to actually get something of worth. If it's a Moody Magus, that's a win. Yeah, never mind. Yeah, by this point, just, uh, I don't know. Uh, shiny flexing the mail. Just want to showcase uh, how close I am because. Thing is, I do have the father. Like, I'm, I've been thinking actually, should I actually wait for the father for like those little things and go for prestige with Grave Digger? Uh, or, or just to do the thing? Still think with a T sleep you would win. Uh, I'm not entirely sure that it still leaves the problem of take, dealing with the other one. Because you just cannot uh, T sleep forever. That's the. That's the thing, you just cannot T-slip forever. I don't know, just uh, 
Maria's prestigious poo poo. Thing is, I'm too much of a. Thing is, I'm too much of an idiot. And also, I'm still waiting for for the essences. Like, see, I'm still uh, one short. So I could totally just uh, wait for it, actually. But yeah, I don't know. That was pretty shit. I'm pretty shit. I'm gonna just stand it here because, uh, boy, that was fucking bad. Apologies for the god awful performance I'm put tonight. Oh, fucking, fucking nerf cripple decker, honestly. And also, hopefully, I get much less reckless. I don't know. I just, I should just take Griff seriously. I've been, I've been actually just uh, taking it the minimum, of, minimum fucking effort. And to be honest, it just should uh, also take a couple of nerfs in some aspects. But yeah, I don't know. You can criticize me. I don't care. It's uh, all fair. Fun and games, I assume. But yeah, uh, see you and good night.